lion, you want to come and read a story with me? Yes, I do. <laughs> hey, this is Dandy Lion. I'm a lion. But I don't look like that. Well, your hair kind of looks like that. Shall we get started? Yeah, I want to read that one. You want to read it? Sort of. I'll read the title. And the lions, stars in the grass. Yeah, and it's by Mia Posada. Mia Posada. There's a ladybug. I know that some people call it a weed. But to me, the dandelion is a noble breed. Bright yellow petals adorn each one, spreading out like rays of the sun. Mm. In spring, dandelions bloom like gold stars in the grass, growing taller and taller as the warm days pass. Look at all that green! Oh, that makes me want to lay in the grass and smell the flowers. Yum, yum, yum. Under sunny summer skies, the flowers are visited by bees and butterflies. The flowers begin to change. One summer day, their bright yellow petals fold up and fall away. In place of petals emerges fluffy tufts of white. Hmm, that's kind of interesting. It is very interesting. I know what these are, too. Do you? Hmm. Pretty? Yeah, they're pretty. They form a perfect circle, delicate and light. Circle. It looks like a globe of flowers. The wind blows them loose, sweeping them into the sky. What are those brown things? They look like little foreign things, don't they? Yes. But what are they? Let's turn the page. Like tiny umbrellas. They're umbrellas? They float up high. No, they're not umbrellas. Every flying tuft the wind has freed carries with it a tiny seed. These are the seeds. Wow. Oh. Well, that makes sense because they fly through the air so they can go everywhere. That's right. The tufts float on the wind until falling to rest. A nice grassy hillside is what they like best. So here he's landed. He's very small, because that's very small. Into the soil a seed snuggles down. Slender new roots tunnel deep underground. <laughs> What was that? Here comes the garbage man. The garbage man is here. The garbage man is here. Yes, we need to wait. Wait until he passes. Okay, lion? It's okay. I think we can handle that. There he goes. I hear his brakes. The garbage people, they drive me crazy. Well, we need to have the garbage people. Why? Because they take away the garbage. The whiskers got a kink in it. Let's fix it. Okay, that hurt. Sorry. <laughs> okay, into the soil, a seed snuggles down. The slender new roots tunnel deep in the ground. So you. 
the sun or the seed reacts to the ground and the moisture and the sun helps it grow. Yes, it does. Fragile green leaves begin to grow, sprouting up from the earth below. And above his little roots. That's right. Look closely and you'll find round buds of green, but bright yellow petals are yet to be seen. That's because they're inside. We have to wait. They're ready to pop out. There they are. The buds slowly open, facing the sky. Sunlight and water will help them grow high. Oh, little bumblebee. Yeah, bumblebees are good. Oh, little butterfly. Yeah, so are the butterflies. What do I see? I think it is. As summer moves on, sunny and warm seeds become flowers. New dandelions form. The name dandelion, here's some more information about dandelions. So let's, maybe mom or dad could read this for you. It's more about dandelions. The name dandelion comes from the French dent de lion or lion's tooth. Dandelions are perennial flowers, which means a new plant can grow from an old root each year. Here is a recipe for a salad. And here's some science. And oh, look at she's blowing the seeds. We make, we call them wishes sometimes, make a wish. <laughs> what would we have without wishes in the world? Yeah, I like wishes. I like making them wish. <laughs> Blowing them. That's a nice, nice book. Good science book. I'm gonna go pick dandelions now. the bell to be notified of new shows. Click on Tumsky to subscribe. Click on the next show you want to watch. Please subscribe and give us a thumbs up. You can follow us on Facebook as well. Look down below under show more. See you soon.